You've heard the saying, diamonds are a girl's best friend, but there's a group of powerful women in New York proving that diamonds are their dynasty. In tonight's Prime Focus, we're going to take you to the city's diamond district to see just how these women are dominating the game and changing the industry. My name is Carrie Levine. Everybody calls me the godmother of diamonds. My other half, good morning. Hello, welcome. A friend of mine sent me a picture of myself at a wedding about 20 years ago. And I was holding a cognac in one hand and the smoking a cigar in the other hand. And when I looked at it, I said to myself, that's it, you're the godmother of diamonds. I am in the jewelry business all my life, jewelry and watches. I need a pair of five carat or six carat diamond studs to show a client today. Somewhere in the 25, the $35,000 range. The Diamond District, it's a hustle. It is 100% a hustle. The only thing that matters is your reputation. I'm Carrie, a pleasure to meet you. What's your name? You have one chance to give a first impression. If you lose that opportunity, it ruins you forever. There's a lot of crazy down here. I've been here for 43 years, I've seen it all. I once got caught in a shootout on 6th Avenue. Back in the 80s, I was coming out of the bank making a deposit and some guy robbed something and I got caught in between two guys and had to duck into a building. So that was kind of like a little crazy and scary. The Diamond District was really a Jewish area built by immigrants who came over from the Holocaust and overseas in Europe because we always had to pick up and run. Diamonds and jewelry were easy to take and barter with and do things. We're gonna buy some diamonds today. It's all about bartering. Peter, let's talk about the lot. What, what kind of a deal we can make on this? 120. 120,000? Yes. But if I'm gonna buy this whole lot, I wanna buy it a little bit better. How much are you looking for? I see 104,000. $400. So what I can do is this much, 108000 How close can you get to my 104000 I'll be losing money. Can we muzzle out at 105000 Everything was always done on a handshake in our business. It was like you shook your hand, you said mazal, meant the deal is done. Okay, mazal. $105,000. Yes. Yes? Yes. $105,000 of the most gorgeous emerald cut diamonds here. I am at the height of my career when I should be winding down and retiring, but I can't. It stimulates me, it, it makes me thrive. I just love doing a deal here and there with people. I appreciate you. Bring me the certificates and bring me the invoice. I used to go up against all the guys in the industry as a young kid. It was very male dominated. But today, there's a lot of women coming into the industry. I love Jules. She's my neighbor. Good morning, America! <laughs> we do a few deals together. When I have people come in with vintage watches, I give those watches to Jules. She's a breath of fresh air. It was a pleasure to deal with you. What do you do? I'm selling dreams. This is what I do in life. Because everybody's dreaming about a watch. Oh my God, you're beautiful! This is the watch? Most of the watches that I sell, it's vintage because it has a history and it's beautiful. The watch has three papers and the year of the watch is... Uh, oh my god, 1995. And the dial is completely original, it's not cracked. I checked the dial already. I'm going to send her picture because she has to see the, the picture first. Check with the husband. Apparently the husband has the money. <laughs> And then she will let me know. But she's very interested. There is no competition. For me, there is none. I came from nowhere. And I'm a woman and I put my name on it. Most of the dealers, they are like next to my place. So I bought this watch in Vegas show and he has a customer looking for this watch. 
I pay 9,000 and I'm gonna try to sell it for 10,5. I mean, I wanna get to 10, but I'm gonna tell him 10,5 because I know that he's gonna negotiate with me on this one. He's here, come, this way. I'm a hard negotiator. Even I'm negotiating on my rent, I'm negotiating when I'm on the street, I'm negotiating everywhere. Show me. Yeah. How much? This one I'm asking 10.5. This is a 40 millimeter, correct? Yeah. 9,500. No. 10. You want to flip? Can we flip the coin? I, I flip with you, I lost. I don't have luck with you. Let's 90, meet in the 90, middle. 5 or 10. He, he is flipping. He's flipping. You call in the air. Go. Heads! Hit. It's okay, you win. But I always win, you know that. Even life, if you win. Life, you always win. I like the hustle. I like the feeling of selling the watch. It gives me a, a feeling of accomplishment. It's like a drug, you know? Now I sold him the watch and I knew that he's going to negotiate with me. I didn't make much. I made $500 on the flip. But don't worry. Another deal, I'm going to catch him. Being a woman in the watch industry, it's magical. When you're a woman and you show them that you're doing deals and that you be, you're better than them and you know how to manage your client, they respect you. And having the respect on men that they're like 20 years in the block, it's the best thing ever. Your ego goes up, you know. We sold around 10 watches now. I think how much we made in total? $6,000? Yeah, $6,000 or $7,000 in five hours. And maybe like $100,000 in sales? One day at the office, the market was very slow. And I say to myself, uh, you know what? Why don't I start a TikTok account? I'm gonna buy this one for 2000 and I'm gonna buy this one for 1150 And we can do even trade because it's your birthday. What about that? That's great. Thank you. Mazal. Mazal. I'm happy Thank for you. you. Thank you. <laughs> I love my followers. Thank I love you. you. <laughs> In two months, I make 100K followers just from TikTok. And then I create my YouTube channel that I'm very proud of. Rich, rich, bling, bling. I own it. Fast money. Get paid. You know it. I started playing around with Instagram and TikTok. Hey guys, it's Kerry here, the godmother of diamonds. And I definitely want to share a very special moment with you. I took off unexpectedly. It, I, in a million years, I never thought it would go where, where it went. Bling, bling. The young kids today come to me like I'm their mother. Help me, talk to me, you know this so well. You're so, you're the OG. Original gangsta. <laughs> or the goat, they call you the goat, the greatest of all time. I'm telling you, the first thing you do is you go work for somebody and you learn the industry. Because if you take your money and you jump into this, you know what you're doing, you're gonna lose your money. I've made a lot of money, I've lost a lot of money. Money is not what rules me anymore. What really makes me go is helping somebody learn. I'm giving you the best advice. You can tell Kirby you spoke to me. They'll take me out in a wooden box on 47th Street because I don't look at it going to work as a job. I love getting up every day and going to work. Well, look at the time, I hustle and grind. Yeah, I would love to have more time. More time to answer people, more time to be here for people. How are you? I would like to inspire more women in the business, to be honest. And just to, to be the, the first successful watch dealer woman in 47th Street or in the world. Well, I think for them, anything is really possible. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.